Now the community is trying to help. Our Amelia Jones shares how you can join the effort to get the family back on their feet. We were all asleep. Gabriela Gomez woke up to the smell of smoke. And I just see like smoke bellowing from the roof and I'm like, we need to get out of here. I was like, get the kids, like, let's get out of here. Fiesta Cancun, the restaurant below the apartment, was on fire. Gomez, her boyfriend Dylan Patterson, and her two kids made it out safe. No one was hurt in the fire. Very scared. Um, just where would we stay? Where would we stay with the kids? The fire happened on March 10th. Since then, Gomez and Patterson have stayed at a hotel nearby. Gomez's kids, eight-year-old Paisley and seven-year-old Bryson, are with their dad and grandparents in Heartland. Paisley's not doing well. She doesn't really know how to process like exactly what happened. We're trying to explain it to her in the best way possible. Patterson showed us these pictures of the apartment since the fire. It's unlivable right now. He says everything has a thick layer of soot. I tried to go back and clean it um, with like Clorox wipes. It was not coming off. A few items were untouched. I was able to salvage actually all of the photos that um, my dad had given me when my grandpa passed away. And her grandpa's rosary. Just thanking God. Western Lakes Fire District is still investigating the cause of the fire. There's a GoFundMe set up to help Gomez and her family. There's another GoFundMe to help the family-owned restaurant, Fiesta Cancun. Their employees have lost their jobs, so um, anything to them would help. Even maybe kind messages as well are appreciated. Thoughts and prayers, yeah. especially. In Oconomowoc, Amelia Jones, Fox 6 News.